Looks like all units are in position. A force of this size should be able to draw out the power of Shining Force to some extent. And the tactics I've given them should also help test their strength. I must admit, I'm looking forward to seeing what they're made of. <laughs> to think that I could become excited over such a thing. Shining Force. Let's see your fabled godlike power now. Preparation of the cannon is still going to take a little more time. How do we use the cannon? The cannon can be used to make long-range attacks based on position information obtained from the gyro terminal. So whoever holds the gyro terminal should travel to the attack point and specify a target. However, at present, the cannon is unable to attack targets that are indoors or that are very far away. The cannon can be used to eliminate groups of enemies in the same area all at once, or to destroy obstacles. No kidding. That sounds pretty impressive. I can't wait to use it. <laughs> huh? What's going on, Zenis? It seems that a large number of creatures has been detected to the northwest of the Geofortress. Creatures? We're getting an image now. It's at the Narda checkpoint. Enemy activity detected 900 feet northwest of the Geofortress. Displaying image. That little brat calls himself the Heriter. This time I'll make sure he learns to fear my army. War beasts, attack! It's that guy again. Ugh. I can't believe the Noswald Imperial Army has made it this far already. Fine then. If they want to fight, then that's what they're gonna get! Please calm down, Master. These creatures are only the advance guard. The enemy's headquarters seems to be located north of the Geofortress. If you intend to drive them off completely, you'll have to go there. If they don't back off quietly, I'll crush their headquarters, too. Understood. I'll input the route to the enemy's headquarters into the radar system. Please check it later. Also, as a reminder, the Narda checkpoint, where the enemies appeared a moment ago, is slightly north of the ruins of Yil Village. Okay, I got it. I'm heading out now.
welcome. You're coming here to find sweet deals on fine items, eh? I will show you some. Many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. Welcome, welcome. You're coming here to find sweet deals on fine items, eh? I will show you some. Many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. Well, if you ever need any blacksmithing done on your equipment, you know where to find me. the Noswald Empire, right? You should hit up my dad's store and get properly equipped. Why is the army invading? I'm scared. Don't sweat it, Hikane. I won't let them lay a finger on you. Okay. Thanks, Toma. If you're going to enemy headquarters, you'll have to travel quite far north after passing through the Narda checkpoint. If you can use the warp gate, the Narda checkpoint isn't that far from the ruins of Yil village.
I've been waiting for you. The Emperor's plan worked perfectly. To think that you would take the bait so easily. What are you talking about? We suspected it wouldn't be too difficult to separate you from the castle. And now that your castle's defenses have been weakened, you get to see the power of the Noswald Army's warp arm. How odd that we'd have intruders at just this moment.
Use exit number 2 to exit at ground level. I'd like you to protect the number 2 photon converter. Did you see the weapon that resembles a dragon? It's called the Dragon Beast. It's a product of the same technology that produced the War Beasts. War Beasts? So it was sent here by the Noswald Empire? The Dragon Beast is a formidable opponent. Please be very careful. So using the warp arm, we're able to send wave after wave of attacks at your castle. How long can you hold out, hmm? Something written here. Let's see. Death awaits those who awaken Garyu from its slumber. Do not proceed. What the heck are they talking about? Huh, I wonder what's up ahead. Yeah! 
See a cave close to you. Unfortunately, even if you head straight to the east to get to enemy headquarters, there's no path for you to follow. The only route is through that cave. The inside of the cave is extremely large. Please go well prepared.
Welcome, welcome. You're coming here to find sweet deals on fine items, eh? I will show you some. Many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. to find sweet deals and fine items, eh? I will show you some. Many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. Gotcha! <laughs> 
Sweet deals and fine items, eh? I will show many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. Welcome, welcome! You're coming here to find sweet deals on fine items, eh? We'll show you some. Many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. thing a while back when some monsters attacked the castle so how much do you want to pay me for this core metal huh 
Thanks for your business. If I find more, I'll be sure to let you know. Use exit number 2 to exit at ground level.
Let's do this!
Oh, this really isn't what I needed today. Welcome, welcome! You're coming here to find sweet deals on fine items, eh? I'll show you some. Many, many thank yous. I always appreciate your patronage. on your equipment. Well, if you ever need any blacksmithing done on your equipment, you know where... Use exit number two to exit at ground level. Those things can attack long distances. Oh dear.
Cannon's initial preparation is complete. You may now fire the cannon at any time from now on. All right, it's about time. Okay, let's try out a practice shot now. Hold that thought, Master. As I have said before, once the cannon is fired, it will take a considerable amount of time to build up enough energy to fire a second shot. If you waste energy on a test shot, you may end up having to wait and not have the resources to fire again when you need to the most. In addition, there is an obstacle protecting enemy headquarters ahead, so it's probably better not to fire the cannon at this point in time. Uh, oh, okay. I guess that'll give me something to look forward to at least. Geo Fortress is pretty powerful. Oh my gosh, that was scary. Uh, amazing. Ah. <gasps> 
So that is the thunderbolt of the gods that the Geo Fortress is fabled to unleash. It is just as it was described in the legends. No, it's even more powerful than the tales. If the Geo Fortress is already this functional, it must mean that, yes, the Holy Sword has been awakened. And that means that now I must meet with the Heritor face to face. I wonder what he's like. Turn the ship, bearing seven o'clock. Come at this base with no plan and just walk right up to the front door. Fools! Drive them back! War beasts, attack! Leave them to me! They're coming! There! <laughs> What's that you said before? For someone with such a big mouth, you sure don't put up much of a fight. This is utterly unacceptable. It sickens me that I was defeated by a child. Of course, he is the heritor. You don't start celebrating too soon. I haven't lost just yet. I still have an ace up my sleeve. Come, Duga. to do, Duga. Keep them busy while I make my exit.
This guy's strong. He ran off! Well, we managed to drive away the enemy, so I guess we succeeded. No, I better not chase them too far. I should head back to the Geo Fortress now. Even so, that Philip guy ran off pretty quickly for all the talking he did. Why did Noswald attack us in the first place? They were probably just feeling us out. Maybe they were testing the power of Shining Force in the Geo Fortress. Philip doesn't lead a regular fighting unit. If I remember correctly, he's in charge of investigating ruins. By the way, there's something I want to talk to you about. It's about that wolfling man, Duga. Wonderful. So this is the Geo Fortress that is said to protect the Heritor. Who the heck are you? It is not my intent to introduce myself to children. I have a proposition for the lot of you. It can't be. That man is... Why is he here? You two know who that guy is? Of course. That is Ragnadon III, Emperor of the Noswald Empire. Huh? Are you serious? To meet the Heritor. Tell me where he is. You're looking at him. What? A child such as you is able to draw the holy sword? Inconceivable. My name is Toma. So why did you want to meet me? To fulfill the ultimate goal of the Noswald Empire since its founding. 
Listen well, young Toma. From now on, you will use this castle and the power of the Holy Sword for the benefit of the Noswald Empire. In return, I will allow you to live. Even I am reluctant to take the life of a child such as you. I don't think so. You talk like a big guy, but who do you think you're talking to, huh? If you want to fight, bring it on! Toma, control yourself! I don't care who you are, Emperor or not! NOBODY TELLS ME WHAT TO DO! This is not what I expected. So rash, so inexperienced and impulsive for the heritor. <laughs> <laughs> Emperor Ragnar's skill is truly unparalleled. So now, you may choose whatever fate you prefer. I could separate your head from your shoulders right at this very moment. Or you could serve me. No way. Not a chance. A foolish and unfortunate choice. That's the last of the mercy you'll be seeing from me! I don't think so! Who's there? There's no way you're getting the power of the Holy Sword. It's mine, Ragna. Oh, it's you! You dare to interfere? Get over yourself, Ragna. Your arrogance is getting old. Hey! Don't you two have your little party without me? Let's try that again, huh? Xion, wh why is she here? You know her, Ami? Of course I do! That's Reem Xion Levise, our leader. She's the chief of the Magnus. Oh my goodness. What should we do? I get the feeling something really bad's about to happen. About to happen? It's already happening! I don't think you two seem to get it. I am the Heritor, remember? So if you guys know what's good for you, you'd better start listening to me. <laughs> Foolish child. Well, it matters not. The Heritor is only a small part of the big plan. Even so, it frustrates me to no end that a contemptuous child such as this, who is ignorant of the purpose of the Holy Sword, has become the heritor. Get your head out of your butt, Ragna. What right do you have to pass judgment? You're a pretty spoiled brat yourself. You want the world to be your toy. Someone ought to put you in your place. Magnus dog, shall I cut you down right here? I'd like to see you try. Hey, you two, knock it off! What, are you gonna fight a war just because you don't like each other? Now who's pathetic? You're supposed to be rulers, right? Well, maybe you should start thinking about your people for a change. Hmm. Yes, you're right. Nothing would be resolved 
even if I were to cut this woman down here and now. <laughs> now you get it. So why not let bygones be bygones and end all of this fighting? Don't be ridiculous, boy. I'd rather die. <laughs> I think this is the first time I've ever agreed with you, Your Highness. These two are hopeless. I will leave things to be as they are for now, but this is not the end. The Holy Sword will ultimately decide the fate of the world. <laughs>